Have fun, but be safe. That is the message from law enforcement working hard this holiday weekend to cut back on drinking and driving. KOET Action 7 News reporter Mike Springer shows us how new at 10. Memorial Day weekend. It can mean firing up the grill, fun with family and friends, and maybe even having a few drinks. And on holiday weekends, like Memorial Day weekend, when people are more festive and people tend to consume more anyway, I, it just adds to that and makes it an even more dangerous situation. Ben Lewinger is the executive director of New Mexico's chapter for Mothers Against Drunk Driving. Last year, Matt says 165 people were killed in DWI crashes across the country during Memorial Day weekend. It's why Matt is partnering up with law enforcement agencies across New Mexico to crack down on drunk driving this Memorial Day weekend with DWI patrols and sobriety checkpoints. Those checkpoints are one of the most effective tools that we have to deter drunk driving. Albuquerque police say they'll be using checkpoints and even DWI patrols to keep an eye out for drunk drivers. And if you get caught drinking and driving at one of these checkpoints, you may find yourself getting a ride home in one of these. Lewinger hopes people heed his warning and think before getting behind the wheel. Please be safe. There, there are lots of checkpoints out there this weekend. Reporting in Albuquerque, Mike Springer, KOAT Action 7 News. A first DWI conviction can bring up to 90 days in jail and a $500 fine.